let's get that Monday feeling on a Friday. Wait. Hi guys and welcome back to yet again another Luca Vision video because this is the second one I've put out on a Friday which is a new music Monday on a Friday and like I said earlier nobody wants to hear that their Friday has turned into a Monday are you crazy? And the reason I am back yet again is because I'm going to be having a little look at Serbia's entry for the Junior Eurovision Song Contest 2020. And I want to give a big shout out and a thank you to ESC Dreamy who has actually told me that Serbia released their song today, otherwise I'd be none the wiser. They're popping out these entrants quicker than some people pop out kids. So yes, I am super hyped to be having a little look at Serbia and their entrant for the Junior Eurovision Song Contest. And it is by Petar Anisic? Anicis? Anisic? Let's say Petar. Petar and his track, Heartbeat. Now, so far, we haven't seen many male competitors for the competition, so I'm really excited and I'm really looking forward to seeing what he can bring to the competition. So far, we have seen so many different genres and different routes and avenues that these songs have gone down. We've seen power ballads, we've seen emotional, soulful songs. We have seen bops, we've seen ethnic bops. We've seen dark pop. So far, this year has been so diverse and so strong. I think it's going to be a really tough competition come November. And I am living for it. So guys, there's only one thing left to do. You got it. Enough chat. Let's react. So let's see what Serbia has to ring with Petar. I'm really looking forward to this. Let's go. Cinematography on point already. So he's starting to paint a picture. Great camera angles. He's got a lovely voice. He's got a great soft vocal. And there's emotion behind it. I love the vocal arrangement. It's very easy to get to grips with. I feel like the song's building very well. Oh, bless him. I love the way his falsetto just comes out within like the second note of the chorus. It provides a really good hook. Okay, there's a subtle kind of trap beat going on within the chorus music here. I just don't feel like the vocal is matching the instrumentation at the moment. I love how he starts the second verse like he did the first verse and the opening with Dali, Dali, Dali creates a good hook. Okay, I feel like this is pretty much the song now. I think after the second verse we've heard what the song is. And it's okay. It's... To me, it's a little bit limp in comparison to what we've heard, but to be honest, we've been spoiled with the quality we've heard so far. I love the emotiveness he has in his voice. You can tell that he really feels what he's singing. I wouldn't turn it off, don't get me wrong. If it was on the radio, I'd keep it on. It's pleasant enough, but I don't think I would choose to put it on. Oh, I love this breakdown. Now the vocal starts on one line, then it goes up another line, then it goes up another line. Until eventually that... Oh, Petar kind of sounds like he's on that cusp of like, it's just, like his voice is just broken. And yet another one where they're using the native language crossed over with English. And this is a very popular trend at the moment, isn't it? I feel like if I was to put this in a genre, I'd say it was easy listening with a modern twist. Oh, I love that ending because you just heard a bit of a heartbeat. Dum -dum. Doom, doom, in the background. That was really cool. I like how it plays on the title. Yeah, it was quite pleasant. I quite enjoyed it. So guys, I think I've pretty much just summed up within that video what I thought. I thought it was okay. It's not my favourite and I don't think it's going to place very, very highly at all. I think the juries will like it, but I don't think the televoting is going to come through for it, I'm afraid. I just found that the song was very much on one level. And in comparison to some of the ethnic bops and the power ballads that we've had, I feel like it might be classed as a bit forgettable in comparison. If you can relate to the lyrical content and the emotiveness in his voice, then he does have the potential to go far. But I think on face value and instant impact, I don't think it has it. But guys, that's just what I think. What I want to know is, what do you think of this track? Let me know all of your thoughts and all of your opinions down below in that comment section. You guys are good at that and you always teach me something new, so I really appreciate your feedback. But guys, that's all from me. All that's left for me to say is thank you so much for watching. Before you shoot off anywhere, don't you forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button, and that bell notification button. So you can keep up to date with all of these random videos that I might just pop out here, there, and everywhere. Just like the Eurovision Song Contest seems to pop out the entrance here, there, and everywhere. Anyway, guys, stay safe, look after yourselves, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, y'all. 
Bye!